Hi everyone, this is Antoine Verville. I am an advanced instructor at Squamish Water Sports, also a team rider at Liquid Force Kites. And today's video will give you a few tips on how to do a back mob. The progression of a back mob is an unhooked inverted back roll with a second rotation while passing the bar. To get to this trick, you should know how to do an unhooked back roll by adding 180 degrees rotation, you should also do a back roll to toe side. Then also practice inverted back roll by leaving the water kicking your back foot up. Finally, landing a few shifty to wrap to make sure the wrap part is nailed before doing it slightly inverted. For this, hold a shifty position for a few seconds, then kick your back foot forward and pull on the bar towards your hips. Try to hold a close circle with the bar while turning, then let go of your front hand. When you're ready for the mob, make sure your kite stay low and that you don't have too much power. The mob is more about how to take off and the way you edge. Make sure to start with the right speed, slacking your lines downwind, then going upwind as much as you can while starting your rotation. Kick your back foot towards the sky as you're leaving the water and at the same time pull the bar towards your hips to help engaging the second rotation. If the first steps are done properly, at this point you should be able to let go of your front hand and to finish your rotation to wrap. Now finally, if you put all those steps together, and you pass the bar in the air, you should be able to land the back mode. Alright everyone, thanks for watching. This video is sponsored by Squamish Water Sports. Visit our websites for everything that regards kiteboarding and water sports. If you like this video, please join one of our kite trips to learn as much as you can while traveling to the perfect kite locations.